Our Children, which is this very harrowing drama from Joachim Lafosse, I think that's paper, I'm, I'm probably pronouncing that incorrectly, um, inspired by real events which took place in Belgium in 2007. It's a film which starts with an image of tragedy and then flashes back to see how that tragedy began. It basically goes back to the beginning of a relationship between uh, Tahar Rahim and Emily, and I'm sure this is Dequien. You see the beginning of their relationship. He has been adopted by Niels Arastrup, who is this doctor who has a lot of money and has taken him un under his wing. And they get together, they get married, they start to have children, but they are living within this really strange domestic situation in which he is providing for them. Therefore, they are effectively trapped within his house, within his care, within his sort of curtilage, as it were. As the family expands, the strains on her become more and more. The relationship starts to fray at the edges. She wants to go back to Morocco. She wants to go to Morocco to take the family there. And in fact, there is one moment in which they appear to be doing that and there is some relief. But then we're pulled back into this situation of depression and frustration. And it is a portrait of a relationship falling apart, of an intimate family, sort of complex family structure eating away at itself. And at the centre of it, somebody going mad, played absolutely brilliantly by, by Emily de Crien. There is this sequence in it in which she's in a car and you see her driving and that song, which I have heard before, uh, Femme vous aime, Women I Love You, or, which is this sort of strange, sort of torchy song. And, she, and they play the whole song and she literally drives while listening to this song and singing along to it. And it is, the, it is an extraordinary piece of cinema because it's a totally static shot of somebody listening to a radio, listening to a song. And during the course of this song, you see this the entire weight of the awfulness of everything they're going through, kind of expressed uh, in her face, in her in her attitude, in the way she holds it. It is a terrific performance, a very, very harrowing drama. As I said, a, big, a drama that begins with tragedy and then goes back and attempts to get somewhere towards understanding that tragedy. Very harrowing stuff.